the ocean is infinite but a wave comes into time wave is water ocean is water but the minute something lifts and you say a wave it comes into time and it rolls along the surface you call that a life then it subsides you call this a death but it's only water who dies there stay as the awareness what does it mean Initially it might feel it takes effort to stay as the awareness what does it mean It means that the attention is habituated to going to the crime scene Isn't it The attention wants to go to where the action is where the mind is creating the action If it doesn't go there is like no action has happened unless and until the mind says something happened effectively experientially nothing happened it doesn't register in consciousness and if it doesn't register effectively nothing happened So did something happen or not You will decide and you will determine whether you wish to call it an event or not It is not imposed upon you This is your power I wonder if you're following it. You determine whether something happened or not. You disregard, it doesn't happen. You have interest in something, suddenly it happens. It's like it's writing itself into your memory. What is the medicine for all of these things? abide as the awareness only keep the attention in neutrality initially it might seem to take some effort but with a little little um, commitment on your part to follow this advice it becomes easier and it moves very quickly into complete ease Next thing you know you say oh my god it took me so long to find out something so simple I have this power I have too much of this power and I would gave it away imagining that I had no power and this power you have some powers Uh, very important powers one power of attention because wherever the attention touches we are registering this as experience next thing belief anything can appear in the consciousness but if you don't believe in it and if you don't identify with it it has no power As i said before a thought without belief has no power
but a thought with belief can start a war. Belief is the important thing. You are learning that not everything that arises needs to be accepted, needs to be pursued. You can ignore. This is the great mastery of the sages. They started to ignore. Not uh, the technique of ignoring. Simply by recognizing I am the beingness. I am the awareness. Everything else is a tourist. Every thought, every emotion is only a tourist. Yes, and I am not a hotel for these thoughts. Let them come and go. And like this, nothing could land. Nothing could leave a footprint in the memory. Everything was passing as it is now. Naturally it is so. Naturally it is so. From your child it has been so. Even now it is so. But we dream and cultivate it a certain type of behavior and a relationship out of ignorance to certain types of thoughts and develop a kind of mindset. And now you are living in your mind game, your mindset. Now you are seeing through these things. They are losing power. Through understanding you are seeing. You are understanding your correct position. You are the awareness itself. In whose presence apparently you have an apparent life, apparent relationships, and it's fine. Enjoy. We are not dismissing negatively, oh, anti-life. It's not an anti-life message. Saying all this can be there, all this is there. It's all the divine play. It is all the divine. It all arises and it is the play of the One. But if you make your stand amongst the transient, the temporary, the changeful, then you will taste suffering. You will come into the feeling of departure, life, death, sickness, all these things, they will become virile concepts for you. But if you remain as the awareness itself, you will see all is passing. The ocean is infinite. But a wave comes into time. Wave is water, ocean is water. But the minute something lifts, 
and you say a wave, it comes into time. And it rolls along the surface, you call that a life. Then it subsides, you call this a death. But it's only water. Who dies there? Name and form, name and form and belief. This is this world. This is a concept, a thought world. We don't, I don't want to talk about these things because I have no teaching to perpetuate like this. I'm only pointing you to that in which all the teaching and the learning and the scriptures and the religions and the beliefs and the doctrines and the heaven and hell and the this and that in you and me and all of this plays and it's fine. It is a display of the eternal being. I have no fight with it. But understand your true position. You are the unchanging, manifesting as changefulness, but not losing power. In the same way that from one candle you can light millions of candles without the original flame losing anything. Everything is arising out of this consciousness that you are. I don't know what you're going to do with these words. They will find their own way. 